to another Monday's Five Hours Track with me, Chris, from the visual guys. How are you all doing? Did you have a lovely weekend? Hi, hi, hi. But yes. Once again, guys, it is Monday. Unfortunately. Back to work, back to school, back to whatever you are doing. But just to make it a bit interesting for you guys. Five attacks. I thought this week's I'll do something different because obviously you might have guessed by the uh, picture. Big Bang Theory. I watched this basically from the start. Fucking love this program. It's funny. It's you learn stuff, but also having fun at the same time, which is what we want. But yes, unfortunately, though, they are coming to a close. A season, what season are we on? Can't even remember what season we're on. But anyhow, whatever season we are on, this is the last one, unfortunately. So, to a bit of tribute, a bit of fur, uh, a bit of. Uh, I thought I'll do some facts about Big Bang Theory. So, excuse me, and I'll burp there. Let's just uh, get to know the Big Bang Theory crew kind of thing. I don't know. Yeah, roll with it. Unlike Sheldon, Jim, who plays Sheldon, has never watched an episode of Star Trek. Nah. Never. Exactly. Penny is the only cast member out of them all that's never revealed her surname. Nah. Chuck, the director, the, the, the uh, yeah, the director of Big Bang Theory has never really thought about it, and it probably will never be, will probably never reveal it. He wants to keep it a mystery. Actress Mayam Bialik. If I've said that wrong, I do apologise. Yeah, sorry, <laughs> but anyhow. Who plays Amy, if you didn't know, actually has a PhD in neuroscience. Yes. She was the behind-the-scenes scientist who, uh, who helped the guys and the cast and the crew become more sciencey off camera and then obviously she got rolled in camera but yeah she actually has a PhD soft kitty warm kitty little ball of fur yes that song the soft kitty song is actually a real song back all the way back to the 1930s but back then it was called Warm Kitty mm. After only two pilot episodes CBS TV offered Big Bang Theory three seasons and they this is a very rare opportunity for people like CBS to do things like this because they are mm, not too sure how are they going to go. But no, CBS, like the two pilot episodes, they offered them three seasons to kickstart the Big Bang Theory. Yeah. And there we go, guys. So there was just five little quirky facts. About Big Bang Theory. I might do a part two on this. I'm not too sure yet. Because there is a lot more facts. I just thought I'd pick up the. 
the more the more ones that would stand out a bit more. So yeah, I might do a part two. If you want to see a part two, let me know in the comments below. And as always, guys, thank you for watching, and don't forget to like, subscribe, share, whatever all this hippity hoppity malaka malaka. But yes, as always, guys, thank you for watching, and uh, yeah. Soft kitty, warm kitty, little ball of fur. Love you, bye.